four now on our breaking news. We're going to take you live to Old Mill Station, where police are speaking about the stabbing of a 16-year-old boy on a TTC bus. This is the second stabbing in just two days. Let's listen in live. Ready to go? This afternoon at about 4 p.m., Toronto Police received a call for a stabbing that was occurring on a bus at Old Mill Station. When officers arrived, they located a male youth with stab wounds to his torso and to his legs. He was taken to hospital by ambulance. He has non-life-threatening injuries. The suspect that was involved in this altercation has fled the scene. He is described as a male unknown race in his 20s medium build, wearing dark clothing, and was last seen heading eastbound on Bloor. There were several members of the public who remained to provide statements to the police and would like to thank them for their cooperation. If anyone else was present on the bus and witnessed this incident, if you could please contact police at 22 Division, 416-808-2200. Do the two individuals know each other? It's still under investigation whether or not the two parties know each other. Uh, and I don't have a definitive answer at this time. Can you give a description of uh, any individuals you're looking for? There's just the one, uh, the one person that we are uh, looking for, the suspect in this matter. Uh, the description, again, is a male in his 20s, unknown race, uh, was wearing dark colored clothing, uh, he's medium build, last seen heading east on Bloor. Um, any indication as to uh, how many people were on the bus at the time? Yeah, I don't have any of that information. Uh, is there surveillance on this bus? Is it good surveillance? There's uh, surveillance video available from the bus. Uh, we'll be uh, arranging to get that downloaded so that we can review it as part of our investigation. All right, that's police providing an update on this incident on the TTC bus where a 16-year-old boy was stabbed in his torso and leg. Luckily, non-life-threatening injuries, but uh, he has been taken to hospital and the search for a suspect, a male in his 20s, continues at this point. Yeah, that investigation continues and police are trying to figure out if this was a random attack. We'll keep a very close eye on that story.